Cyril Azha Umar was released alongside numerous non-citizens following a landmark High Court ruling two weeks ago in Australia may face the possibility of returning to prison under laws similar to those used to deal with terrorists which are being considered by the Australian government. According to Australian news reports, the offences being mentioned include rape, murder and paedophilia. Cyril, who is facing the death sentence in Malaysia for the murder of Mongolian Altan Tuya Sharibu together with former police colleague Azila Hadri, is consistently referred to as a hitman who blew up the body of a pregnant Mongolian woman after killing her in most of the Australian news reports. Australia will not deport Cyril to Malaysia as the country's laws do not allow those facing the death sentence to be repatriated to their countries of origin. According to the Sydney Morning Herald, citing two sources, the government has sought legal advice on the prospect of using preventive detention-style laws to re-detain non-citizens who had served jail time for offences such as rape and murder. The report said the government was seeking to learn if it had the authority to enact new rules before the High Court publishes the full reasons for its decision next year.